Sodom and Gomorrah. It's, this is a divine judgment against sodomy. San Francis Co. Company. And Chick Ago. Bye bye, chicks. Hello, dudes. Oh, bummer. Ow, bum. Er. Ow, bum. Why the pandas are being sent back to China. Panda eyes. Sodomy. Sex crimes. Any place that's associated with that. So, San Francisco. Chick-a-go. Um, the, ch the children. The children. So, Vatican. Yes. That's what's about to happen. So, any, any organization or location that is in support of or is associated with this type of um, lifestyle choice, the danger that I saw to the Tuckers, I made that Target Tucker video, I've been thinking just hate crimes kind of stuff. Brandon Tina, I talked about in Nebraska in that video. A lot of things I talked about in that video, Target Tucker, but that's what I've been thinking. I have not been thinking Sodom and Gomorrah, Divine Judgment. But now, mobs could be the tool that is used to exact divine judgment on these people. It might not be sulfur stones falling from the sky. It might. Volcano eruption would send sulfur stones up and then down. And if it was a violent enough eruption, they could actually come from far away and look like they were just coming from the sky. Like, whoa, where did these sulfur stones come from? You know? That would be a hell of a blast. It seems like you would know where they came from if it was from a volcano. But it could be that it happens in different ways, in different locations, based on the tools at hand the handiest tools at hand like in America it could be mobs or it could be nukes and overseas it could be a volcano any place people organizations that are associated with crimes of this nature against nature these crimes against fertility the hokey pokey really is what it's all about, and you need a pee pee to make a BB. I don't know why, y'all, but that's what's about to happen. Disassociate yourself now if you haven't already. If you're at all involved in, in this kind of stuff. Just saying.